Man, and just like that, the stakes have never been higher. I need to be stopped. Hey guys, and welcome back to Snackable. So today we are trying something that's a little higher in the price range than we normally go, uh, but I think it's something that collectively we all know is delicious, but we see it in a gas station or a grocery store and we go, that's, that's a little too high price for me. Or we see a unique version of this snack and we go, I wanna try it, but what if it's not good and I just spent eight to $16? It is Jack Link's Extra Thick Cut Steak Strips. So technically speaking, this is beef jerky because it's seasoned, smoked, and dried beef. Uh, but it's, it's more like a steak than anything, which is what is intriguing to me about it. Um, it does cost uh, about $8, $8.50 uh, at a uh, grocery store. Um, so it is going to be more on the more expensive side of things. But if you're, you know, either a hunter or you just like to eat beef jerky, uh, I mean, we're going to find out if it's snackable or not. Uh, it's intriguing to me, and I really wanted to try it, and I thought this would be a perfect occasion to do it. Um, now, it's this is a little cheaper than most of the beef jerky I've seen before. Usually, like, a really big bag that you can get at Sam's Club or something. It's, like, $16. I used to get that all the time. But then I would get, like, little bits of beef jerky stuck in my teeth, and I'd be pulling them out for two years. And then they'd finally come out, and I'd get gingivitis, and it was horrible. You know, not all of that happened, but it did get stuck in my teeth. Now, first, of course, we're going to look at the nutritional information. Uh, three servings per container. And a serving is about one ounce. Uh, so for the whole container, it's 220 calories. Um, sorry, I'm having trouble reading this. It's so, so red. Uh, total fat, 4.5. Sodium is 1,100 milligrams. So that's 43% of your average um, you know, amount. Is that 43? No, it's, I'm sorry, that's 48. Sorry, there's a piece of dust in the way, and it's so red that you can't see anything else. Uh, yeah, so I mean, listen it's nine grams of protein. So, and it's gluten-free now. So everybody can enjoy it. Mmm. Smells just like every other beef jerky I've ever had, but, uh, it's probably not going to look just like any other beef jerky I've ever had. Oh my gosh. I mean, I think, I think it's going to be snackable. Um, it'd be very difficult to, to mess this up, but let, let's try. Now, instead of you having to listen to me sloppily eat this delicious beef jerky, I've decided to do this voiceover so that you can watch me devour it, but not have to hear me devour it. Know what I mean? The, the flavor really wasn't there. It was there a little bit. Uh, as I got deeper down into the bag, though, the flavor was just exploding all over the place. Um, I think the whole steak strip aspect of it is sort of a ripoff um, because, I mean, in the picture, it shows these long strips, and they're not. Like, there was maybe one that was like this, but it was so thin, it was that way the whole time. Um, so it's, it's, not, it's not like this, unfortunately. And you saw some of the smaller pieces and everything. So it's good. Um, but, I, you know, I wouldn't make any special trips just so that you could get this. You know, it's not going to be anything too, too special. And calorie-wise, I mean, it's a no-brainer. It's going to be, like, so full of protein. It's going to be high on sodium. It has to be. Now, if they came out with a teriyaki version, I'd be interested in trying that because teriyaki beef jerky is fantastic. And nobody can tell me that it's not. Um, but, yeah, if I had to rate this anywhere... Uh, probably a six. I've had beef jerky that I think was an eight. And this, this just wasn't as good as that. And the pieces weren't as large. They're sort of like smaller pieces. Like imagine if you got a really small steak, like a six ounce, and they just cut up pieces of that and then cut those pieces in half. And then like, you're not getting a full steak in here, which is a upsetting in of itself, but it is still snackable with a six. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment down below what I should try next like and subscribe we're getting you know we're getting pretty close to 200 so i'm excited about that uh but i guess we'll have to see what we're eating next time bye